Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, <laughs> yeah, I think we've all seen the new, the trailer for the new game pack by now, right? Um, this is gonna be just a little rant for me, okay? Because I'm not happy, not at all. I'm really sorry, but I'm not. Um, this is not what I wanted. I think this isn't what a lot of us wanted. I think a lot of us were more excited for like, maybe a winter theme or whatever. But seriously, Star Wars? Star Wars out of all of the things. Oh, I know there were rumors that it might, that it could be Star Wars. Uh, I'm just really disappointed. Uh, this is definitely not what I, ex not what I wanted. I think it's, I think it's kind of what I expected them to do because the winter theme was a little, because I know they 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 said earlier this year that the new game pack was going to be something that they haven't done before, so of course that means that a winter theme is out because they did that in The Sims One with the holiday. I think it was like a holiday pack or whatever, so you could go on like a winter vacation and things. So that was out, um, but I was really hoping it was going to be something different. Um, I'm really disappointed. Uh, this might actually be... I mean, usually I buy all the packs um, as soon as they drop. This might be the only one that I actually don't buy at all. I've never said that about a Sims game before, uh, or an expansion or a stuff pack. I even bought the My First Pet Stuff Pack because I like the look of the uh, little critters that came with it, the hamsters and the... Um, uh, yeah, all those small animal cages and things. So this might actually be the first one that I don't buy. I'm gonna wait just a little bit and see. Uh, just I'm gonna watch some videos about the gameplay and stuff, and uh, then I'll make my final decision. But this decision. But for now, I'm just like, this is not gonna be for me at all. I'm I'm not a Star Wars fan whatsoever. I've watched one of the movies, um, just because <laughs> this is actually a little bit of a fun story. Um, the only Star Wars movie I've watched was the movie that I had my first date to. So my very first date was to go watch a Star Wars movie in cinemas. Uh, wasn't my choice, obviously, because I'm not a Star Wars fan at all. This must have been around like... 2000, 2001, I think it was more likely 2001, 2002 maybe. Um, Star Wars fans, you probably know which movie came out around that year. Uh, I don't even know which one it was. I know it was Natalie Portman. Uh, I know Natalie Portman was in it, but that's all about all I know. So that's my only Star Wars experience and it didn't leave me wanting more, so to speak. <laughs> um, space in general, just, it isn't my thing at all. Um, yeah, I'm very disappointed. I think a lot of us are. I think we were expecting something more. We were expecting something that just, I don't know. Uh, yeah, I'm really disappointed. That's, that's pretty much all I have to say. <sighs> It feels like, I mean, I've only talked for four minutes and I've basically said all there is to say about it. I don't know what else to fill up the time with right now. It's just, yeah. Um, anyway, you can leave your thoughts about it in the comment section below. I would like to, it would be fun to hear what you have to say about it. If you feel the way I feel or if you are like a big Star Wars fan or something, maybe you find this exciting. Um, I just don't. I was hope, actually hoping that if it was Star Wars themed, that it would be a little bit maybe similar to Into the Future from The Sims 3, because I actually liked that expansion pack. I think that was an expansion pack um, where you could go into the future and meet your ancestors or whatever they're called when they're like your relatives from the future. I don't know. I think it's ancestors anyway. Um, I thought that was a fun com concept. I was hoping it would be kind of like that, but it doesn't look like it is. <laughs> um, the trailer was just very underwhelming and 
I couldn't really figure out if like is do you have to build these locations by yourself is there gonna be a new world with it is there gonna be like are you gonna be able to travel to like a Star Wars themed world with your spaceship I really didn't understand much about it and like these past few trailers that they've dropped have been so underwhelming they haven't shown enough of the gameplay and I mean you can't really get a grip on it from these past few trailers that they've that they've sent out for The Sims 4. Uh, it's all going to shit basically. Sorry. Uh, I'm really disappointed. Um, yeah. I, I don't know what else to say. I, I hope you guys enjoyed that trailer more than I did. I hope, um, I hope all of you aren't as disappointed in this as I am. Um, EA, please do better. Please do something else. Please, please give us what we want. Like, please just listen to what we want instead. Because right now it feels like they, it feels like you don't. It feels like you don't care about the community at all at this point. So, um. I think that's all I had to say. Uh, I will talk to you in my next video.